Welcome to Nibbles by Afro Lems this Christmas. So today I'll be making honey garlic shaki. Yes, yes, honey garlic shaki. It's actually on my blog. If you follow my blog, you'd have seen me make it. But for Christmas, I thought, why not? I mean, other channels on YouTube, especially foodies, they would make jello fries and all the other things. But when your guest gets in and then they're waiting for the rice to be ready or the swallows to be ready, you want to make sure that they have other things to nibble on. That's why I'm doing the Nibbles by Afro Lems series this Christmas. So today, for that, we would need shaki. If you are not Nigerian, shaki you, is also known as tripe. You can find it in the Asian grocery stores. Um, they would have the honeycomb one and it may not need to cook as long as the Nigerian one would. But I've already cut it into strips cleaned and washed it so I'm going to put it in the pot and then I'm going to cut some pepper and onion just to make this a bit more flavorful so once these are all chopped I'm going to toss it in the pot with the shaki Then season with some salt. And seasoning cubes. And then I'll add my water and allow this boil till it's soft. So we're gonna leave this to boil for a little bit. Once it's soft, we would make our honey garlic. So our shaki should be done. It smells amazing. So let's just stir to make sure. Yep. Soft. So I'm going to take it off the heat and put my pan that I'm going to stir fry back on. And then put a little bit of oil. Let this heat up and we've already chopped some onions, garlic and pepper but I'll chop a few more pieces of garlic just so that we get the garlic flavor for the honey garlic shaki. Alright, just swirl our oil and test with a little bit of onion just to make sure the oil is hot. It's hot enough. So we're going to toss this in. There. Now because we have already generously seasoned our shaki, we may not need as much seasoning here, but we'd still add a bit of salt and pepper. If you still feel like you need more seasoning, you could add that as well. So I'm adding salt and black pepper. I'll stir that. And then I'm going to take pieces of the shaki, strain a bit of the water, and then add that. All right, so we're gonna add our honey now. Just a little bit. And finally, we'll top with sesame seeds. And turn this off. When we come back, we'll plate our shaki and try it. And I guarantee you'll love it. So now that our honey garlic shaki is ready, I'm just going to serve little tiny portions for me and you. These are sweet, they're spicy, they're very flavorful, and I guarantee your guests are going to 100% enjoy it. Forgive my sniffling, 
the pepper was intense. So I'm going to just garnish with a bit more sesame seeds. And if you have um, access to dill or any other green um, vegetable, you could garnish with that as well. And that's it. So this is for you guys and this is for me. Let's try. So good. Merry Christmas.